Taiwan dye technology has been turning recycled PED bottles into blankets and shawls that are vital to Ziji's disaster relief effort. The company has also been working hard to show the public that one can look good and still be eco-friendly as well. At the pavilion of new fashion at the 2010 Taipei International Floral Expo, visitors learn about being fashionable and eco-friendly all at once. Here, dye technology is showcasing 18 sets of garments made from recycled PET bottles at the 2011 Fashion Festival. From my past experience with dye technology, I remember that their clothing was rather simple and ordinary in design, but what I have seen today is quite different. I'm actually very interested in the one showcased today. A discarded PED bottle at the hand of dye technology becomes a trendy attire. However, the path was not without obstacles. We had to meet Master Jinyin's ideal in the design process, which was not without challenges, but it was quite different from what is normally seen as fashionable. Through it, we hope to inspire change in the fashion industry. Our main focus is to let the general public know that we have more than just blankets in terms of eco-friendly goods. Any fabrics we use in our daily life can be made so, and be fashionable as well. Though dye technology may never become a major designer label, at least people now know they can look good and be nice to our planet at the same time.